Okay, so first off, big apologies because I will not be getting that second knife video out this week because, and it's not entirely my fault, this happened. Fluke news update, there is a massive, a massive storm coming into Auckland, one of the cyclones, and the whole of AUT campus and Auckland campus are closing at 11, which is in 15 minutes, so we have to run. So there was a storm warning, and of course, if you're in Auckland, you know that that storm, that was supposed to be the worst thing in 30 years, it never came. So they closed the, they closed the university for nothing. And that was my last day to get the stuff done that I need to get done in the workshop before mid-semester break. And of course now the workshop is closed at mid-semester break. But, 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 I did phone them. For all other students' inquiries, press one to the student hub. Number one. And after waiting a long time on the phone, they're gonna see if they can reopen the workshop for one day next week in my mid-semester break. So, there is a delay on that video, but it will come out next week. So instead, I'm gonna make a very quick, very short, very interesting video about my impossible dreams. What are they? Well, let me tell you. Number one, I want to become a world-class product designer. Now, I know that's very cliche about people going, I wanna be the best again, when you want Okay, maybe it is a bit cliche, but product design for me is all about fixing problems. It's, oh, it's hard to describe, but coming to design school, it's sort of like I've realized that this is what I want to do with the rest of my life. Number two, I would like to win an X Prize. An X Prize is this, this massive, massive amount of money, several million normally, that's been put up. So teams come together and they have to create something that really pushes the boundaries of what humans are doing. Like for example, the Lunar X Prize which is uh, a 30 million dollar prize that's been put up by Google to inspire engineers, entrepreneurs and innovators from around the world to develop low cost methods for robotic space exploration. Once this is achieved, this will be incredible. And if I could if I could do one of those with the team, if I could win one of those prizes, that would be amazing. Number 3. One day I would love to do a TED talk. I don't know what that's going to entail. I have no idea what I talk about, but one day, one day I'll do it. Impossible dream number four. I want to win a product design competition this year, in 2017. It's impossible, but I could do it. That's what I'm going to aim for. Impossible dream number five. I want to release my first product in 2018. I realize that's next year. And I'll still be a student. But is that an impossible dream? Yes, can I achieve it? I don't know, maybe. Now obviously it's all fine and dandy having all these impossible dreams, but you need a plan or at least a strategy to begin achieving them. So, what I've noticed is there are two, two main things that will really help you in your career. Number one is, you know, become really, really good at what you do. And for me that's going to be becoming really really good at product design. And this year they'll be learning tools like SolidWorks, which at the moment I really struggle with. And becoming badass at my design drawing. That's another thing that I need to work on. And learning all the different aspects of design. And that's all going to happen while I'm at uni. The second thing that's really going to help you with your career is networking. This is a must. Now what I'm doing in this place is I have recently signed up for the Designers Institute which is basically a massive group of all the designers in New Zealand. I went to one of their events just the other day and man, it was so nice. It, was, it felt like I had found, I had found my people. Mm -hmm. That's what I felt like. There's so many cool, inspiring people there. I think if you're really good at what you do and you're fully networked with, in a really good community with all sorts of people, smarter people than you, people in different areas than you, if you've got those two things going for you, you could have a great career. So yeah, those are my dreams and my very beginning of a plan that I'm putting in place to achieve them. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to achieve those dreams or which ones I'll achieve, but you know, <laughs> that's all part of the, the adventure. That is the journey. And that's what I'm doing right now. And this is what you're watching. Whoa. Oh, good.